Hello everybody! In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix this file system error. And this error often appears when people are trying to open a photo or video, but you may also face it when starting an application. If you suddenly encounter this problem and wonder how to fix it, watch this video to see several methods to get things right. The peculiarity of this bug is that there is no solution that works in every case, and what helps one user may not work for another. Hello, friends! If you need to recover deleted data, view or restore removed browsing history, Hetman Software Products will help you. Follow the link in the description, download the necessary program for free, install it and analyze the disk. The utility will show you the data you can recover, so you will be able to view it or get it back. In our channel and blog you will find solutions to any problem, from installing an operating system or configuring it to fixing possible bugs and errors or optimizing mobile gadgets. Our specialists will answer any questions you ask in your comments under the videos or articles. The first method to try is to get access to the folder Windows Apps for the current user. In other words, you need to get owner's rights for this folder. This method is also good if the Windows 10 operating system says you have been denied permission to access this folder. Watch a special video on our YouTube channel about taking ownership of a file or folder. You can find the link in the description. First, follow the path C – Program Files and find the folder Windows Apps. If you don't see it there, your computer may have the option to display hidden folders disabled. To find out, click View and check if the option for hidden items is enabled. If it isn't, check the box and the folder should appear. Right-click on the folder and select Properties. In the window that opens, Click on the Security tab and then choose Advanced to open the Advanced Security Settings window. In the Owner line, click Change. In this window, enter your account name and click Check Names, then OK. After the changes are applied, you'll have to restart the computer. In most cases, the problem should be fixed, but if this method failed in your particular case, just try the next one. The second method is about resetting all your applications. To do it, start Windows PowerShell as administrator, and you can find it by right-clicking on the Start menu. Then type and run the following commands one by one. You can find all commands in the description under the video. Some of them may take a long time to perform, so you will have to wait until all operations are accomplished. You will have to restart the computer after these commands are performed, and also you may need to reinstall the Photos app from Microsoft Store. You can find it in the Start menu or by typing Photos in the Search field and just install it again. If you encountered this error when opening a photo and resetting applications didn't help you, you can try replacing the new Photos app with the classic Windows Photo Viewer. To do it, you should type several commands or run a ready-made RAG file, and you can find the link to this file below this video. After the changes have been applied, just right-click on the photo and select Open with, choose another app and select the one you like from the list.
The archive will also contain a special reg file to cancel the changes you have made. Another possible cause of this error is poor integrity of the system files or infection by viruses or other malware. Check the links in the description to find out how to check system files for integrity and how to scan your PC for viruses and remove them. If all these methods failed, your only option is to bring your computer back to its original condition. Yet before you do that, it's worth checking for available updates and install the latest one. It can also help to fix the problem. The most reliable way to get rid of the file system error is by resetting the computer. You can watch one of our videos to learn more about it and you can find the link in the description as always. Go to Settings, Update and Security, Recovery and then click on Get Started. This method is also good for fixing other problems related to the work of your computer's operating system. This way you can save your files and then just reinstall Windows. When the process is over, you will get a clean operating system. And that is all for now. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Leave comments to ask questions. Thank you for watching and good luck!